One of the key challenges facing black-owned businesses is access to capital, and while government has committed several million dollars to their black industrialist program, it's the country's banks and development finance institutions that provide the money. Many financial sectors are much more tuned towards providing consumer credit and, uh, than they are to provide uh, you know, uh, support for, for businesses. And we need to get more uh, resources into supporting uh, business activities, and particularly in the sectors that are going to take our economy further forward. A challenge facing many entrepreneurs and smaller businesses is locating and accessing those DTI incentives that will give them the tools to grow their operations. We did more infographic type of intent, so it makes it much more easier for a customer to look at and understand. So even, even if our, our frontline staff have had to look at the infographics, it will make it so much easier for them to explain to the customer the process and what to, how to apply and what to apply. The Black Industrials program has already approved 52 projects with a projected investment value of around $346 million, creating 9,000 jobs, which has been co-funded with other financial institutions. Are we at the scale we need to be? Have we got uh, all the national champions that we need? No. Um, but certainly I think we can see value in the program as it's been working. And I think the value in the program is that, uh, well, first of all, we make sure that you are actually someone who's going to be a real entrepreneur in the manufacturing space. And then secondly, where we support you, we support you to become more productive, more competitive uh, than you already were. The DTI incentive scheme isn't comprehensive, but it's a good starting point for established black businesses. Many of these black industrial uh, industrials who are at the moment sitting in their in the, in the normal, normal sort of turnover of businesses could springboard to doubling their turnovers by, by getting this uh, injection from the DTI. Most businesses are looking to take the next step to either grow their businesses or diversify their businesses. And incentives and access to those incentives is key in that growth opportunity. I'm Angelo Coppola for CGTN in Johannesburg, South Africa.